Hey there guys, it's your good pal Wiggly, and welcome back to more Let's Play Hollow Knight Blind. In the last episode, we continued exploring Green Path, meeting the uh, the lady in red, Hornet, proper. And she said some ominous words about not letting us be able to do what we're doing. And then we saw some ghosts who basically uh, corroborated that. Corrob is that the word I'm looking for? They they agreed, and they like knocked us out or something. I don't. I have no idea what happened there, if I'm being honest. <laughs> and in this episode, we're going to be continuing onward. Um... We have two directions we could go now, uh, seemingly. It seems like we can go down to Fog Canyon, or we can go southeast. And uh, my, my brain is taking me southeast, because Fog Canyon seemed like uh, quite the spooky place with jellyfish just launching at me at mock speed. So I will go ahead and meet you guys over there at the area that I want to go to right now. Wait a minute, what's glowing down there? Hold on, hold on. Um, can I, can I make that? Oh, dude, don't, don't tease me like that. Oh, man. Okay, maybe, maybe I'm giving up too easily on that, but I really, I really don't want to die to acid. Oh, over here we have a. Uh, some more, some more thornage going on. I don't think I've ever gone over this way. I think I just kind of went straight up here. I don't think we ever went um, west here at all. So we are officially in new territory, which means it's time for me to start talking once again. Um, I apologize if an episode if an episode comes out long or if an episode comes out short. Uh, also, the the thorns are bleeding. Um, I apologize if an episode comes out long or short. Uh, with the way that I edit videos and how I edit out, like, backtracking and whatnot, um, uh, it's kind of, it gets kind of hard to tell, um, just how long the video is actually going to be, so I hope you guys are okay with some episodes that might be closer to the 30 minute mark, might be closer to the hour mark, maybe a little over sometimes, just depends on how much progress I feel like I've made. From moss and leaf our life is drawn, while it grows upon the path we shall never wilt. Neat. I wish I I wish I knew who you were. But alas, oh, that's a that's a big boy. This area is not seeming much more friendly than Fog Canyon, but he just he just kind of seems to be like a uh, a ride on the way over here. Okay. What do we got? Nope, that's this is not a place we're supposed to be. What was that sound? Did the did the music change? Uh Are you just like an infinite soul farm? No, of course you aren't. But we did get your uh your entry. Duranda. Oh, okay. If you if you get like an update, you can just press right on You can just press the the thing, the touchpad immediately. And he'll just pull it right up, right away. Uh, I don't think we've read this one. Uh, Balder rolls into a ball and propels itself at intruders who wander into its territory, aggressive even when newly born. Younger hunters delight in catching these creatures and rolling them around for sport. <laughs> I encourage you to indulge yourself if, if, if the fancy strikes you. Okay, sounds good, man. I appreciate it. Um, I don't think I've... Uh, charges at prey with his needle-like... Proboscis. Proboscis? Proboscis? Tobuscus? Uh, when they lunge at you, don't panic. Stand your ground and strike back as they come close. Cool. Okay. I really I really want to know more about Hornet. <laughs> and I and I I expect that several other people feel that way and echo that sentiment. Corroborate. I still I I I don't know. I have no idea if I'm using that word correctly. I apologize. I'm being kind of goofy this episode, man. Okay, well, I guess, um, I guess Fog Canyon is going to be our, uh, our next destination, so I'll go ahead and meet you guys over there. Here we are back down, uh, pretty close to where the, uh, the entrance to Fog Canyon is. We can go over here now that we have our, uh, our new, um, dash ability. Um, this area looks incredible. This background, I don't even know if this background, oh my god. Hello. Wow, okay, okay, we've got a boss here. Could I have, like, skipped this boss entirely, I wonder? 
it's interesting. Oh, he's gonna leap too. But yeah, this this background, I I guess maybe I wasn't I wasn't crazy. Oh, there we go. This background seemed more detailed because this room is more important. There we go. All right, you just need to watch and react to see if he's going to leap or if he's going to lunge. He's gonna lunge here. Of course he is. I thought for sure he was gonna leap. Okay. Well, that was a bit that was a bit greedy. Okay, that dude wasn't that bad. Oh, but now we've got three of these guys to deal with. Or not. I guess they didn't... Okay, okay, that's good. Alright, uh, Massive Moss Charger. Family of creatures that have learned to bulk up with moss and live as one. Oh, there was multiple of them, okay. There is strength in numbers, yes, but these creatures never had much strength to begin with. Cut through their trickery. Of course. Okay. Um, but I'm curious to see what's going on up above. Is this just for the... Um, an alternate path for the good players? <laughs> uh, it's just one of these, like, soul punch things. Okay. Makes sense. Alright, I'm safe to charge there. This dude can't hurt me there. Give me the money. I didn't even hear you exist. And now let's see what we have even further left. Okay. I don't think I'm ever going to get tired of this game's environment. I could probably stare at this, this, this one area forever, I think. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that was an extremely suspicious little nook up there. Get out of here. Enough of your trickery. All right, we're we're swimming in money, which I I hope that there's like some sort of banking system, or at least something to spend it on in the near future, because I have so much, and nothing to do with it. Especially if I keep getting hit by this dude, and I lose it all on my way back here. Come on. Okay, gotta be very careful. Yeah, there's acid down here. Of course. Alright, well, I, I was going to go to Fog Canyon, but there seems to be a significant more amount of green path for us to see. And I don't like leaving an area without um, seeing what there is to see. Because if we can see the sea, then I suppose we'll see. Okay. Uh, further down, once again, we have more of this guy. We just got to ride him. There we go. Doesn't even seem like it really affected anything. I see a chest up there. I just noticed how, how long your legs are. I suppose that makes sense. I guess I just... Fuck. I guess I just kind of thought that you were... Uh, you were, like, floating. And not walking. But I suppose I was mistaken. You really have to time that super well. Okay. And uh, loads of money is my reward. Okay. Sounds good to me, but there's more to see over here. I hear something. Oh, hello. My friend. My son. I will save you. Worry not. Yeah. Happy boy. Okay. <laughs> I love them. I love them so much. Okay. Um, there's something up there. Uh, can I even... No, I can't make that. At least not from here. Huh! Nope. Okay. Damn. Oh, I gotta go, like... Man, I shouldn't have come all this way. Now I gotta, like... <laughs> now I gotta go all the way back. Damn. Okay, well, I guess I'll... I'll meet you guys back over in Fog Path, or Fog Canyon. You know what I mean? Here we are, once again, back in Fog Canyon. Um, I wonder if, uh... Okay. Uh, I seem to just kind of... need to... not hit these dudes. Damn! That does so much damage. Yeah, okay. Uh, hitting the jellyfish is sort of a bad plan, I think, but I want to get there... 
<laughs> I want to get their their entries. Okay. All right, buddy. Hut, and then get away. Damn. Okay. How many? How many do I gotta kill? Fifteen? Nine? Okay, maybe not. Maybe not right now. I really like the uh, the muffled, super echoey sound effect. Oh, but how do I heal? If I can't hurt dudes, I can't get soul. Man, this area is... Okay, not that right now. No thanks. None of that at the moment. Thank you very much. I'm good for now. Alright, these little ones we can just kind of freely freely take out, but the the big ones, on the other hand, are something else, dude. That's so... How, how do they expect me to avoid that? Maybe they don't, but I want the, I want the entry. Okay, I see what they want me to do here. Huh, there we go. Let me get to a bench. There's a stag station over here. A stag way. Come on. Where is it? All right, I have a plan. Get out of there. There we go. Okay, I don't, I don't like this area. <laughs> I mean, I do. I like it, but in terms of like spookiness, not spookiness. What the hell am I trying to say? Um, in terms of feeling safe, I do not. Oh, there's thorns in here too. This area is mean. Okay. I have to be close to having their, uh, their entry now, right? Alright. Get out of there. Okay, there we go. I feel like I killed a lot of the small ones. At first I thought that the, uh, the electricity was, like, making me take damage. Okay, there we go. Uh, smallest jelly form. Passive and un unaware, but pulsing with a dangerous electric charge. The spirit of a dead ancestor? The brain of a larger creature allowed to drift free? An egg searching for a safe place to spawn? I have no idea what this is. <laughs> That's fascinating. Okay. Where's... Where's my stagway? I can't even pull up the map, man. Not having a map feels so... Oh, there it is. Dehabilitating. Queen Station. That's not at all what I thought I was in for. Man. Fungal wastes, where are we going? Okay, don't want to go over there. Too many too many new things all at once. Getting slightly overwhelmed. Is this just like the central station, maybe? There's a lot of dead dudes. Please be friendly. Yes, okay. Hello. Hi, Willow. Oh, come in search of treats, have you? I chanced upon a unique little fungus growing right above us. I found it only in this station, and the taste is just divine. This place must be this place must have once been quite the hub, built at the border between two lands, that misty drop to one side and those bulbous growths another. Neither place seems particularly welcoming, so while my little treat lasts, I think I'll stay right here. Sounds good. Yeah, yeah. Feel free to stop by any time, though I do like the quiet in this station. A little company is, al is always good for one's health. I like you. You're fun. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's cute. I like her. Go ahead and uh, enjoy your snack. Okay, so this is like a connecting way between two areas. And it, it certainly seems like it might be like the central stag way, too. Finally, a bench. Good lord. Map updated. Except I don't have a map. Rip. Yeah, take my money. I have, I have plenty of it. This game seems insanely free with where you can go. At what time? Alright, what do you have to say? 
You've opened several stag stations now, haven't you? I'm thankful for the opportunity to once more travel through the kingdom. As I visit more places, I feel my memories returning to me, like the stagways of my mind are running once more. Continue to open stations, and you'll have my deepest gratitude. <gasps> Sounds good, man. Ah, oh, this gladdens me. The Queen Station has opened once more. This place was a bustling hub of travel, well-placed for travelers visiting the outer edges of the land. You're quite the explorer to find this place. Okay. Sounds good. I'm glad I'm glad I can help a brother out, you know. Okay. Uh up up there we go. And definitely can't do anything from this direction. But there's something in there. Though I'm not I'm not brave enough to try to figure out how to go about getting there with my current skill set. I would I would love to have a map, man. <laughs> I'm I, I may be a little too reliant on it. Alright, fungal wastes. This area seems just as mean as the other one, it's true. Willow did not lie to me. Okay, I think we're gonna I think we're gonna stick to Fog Canyon for now. I think that that would probably be wise. What does the overall map look like? I, I can't even... <laughs> oh, man. I can't even, like, see the layout, really. I can, like, imagine it. Okay, what's this place? Some sort of garden. <gasps> Hello, old lady. Hello there, dearie. I was about to close up shop and run until you came along. I provide a banking service. Well, I just fucking, I just, I just asked for this. This game is perfectly paced, bro. What the heck? <laughs> I literally was just talking about I wanted a banking service. Actually, I don't know if I said it out loud. I think I did, but I, I at least thought it. I hope I said it out loud so that I can, like, <laughs> actually call back on it. Losing one's geo is a terrible thing, and it's so much more likely if you carry it on if you carry it about on yourself. My vault is much more secure. In all my time as a banker, I've never lost a single geo. Perhaps you'd consider opening an account. I would love to open an account. Yeah, a hundred, whatever. That's fine. Just you, geo. You're a smart one. Next time's next time some dreadful beastie gets the best of you, you'll be glad to know your geo's safe with my shell er my vault. <laughs> really? <laughs> now let's do some banking. <laughs> do you just not move? Is that why? Is that why? Okay. Uh max balance forty five hundred, that's it? Okay, we'll keep uh We'll keep, we'll keep a nice stack of 300-ish on us, I think. I haven't come across anything that takes more than, like, what I need. Or, like, 100. That was terribly worded. I'm sorry. It's very late right now, but I really want to keep playing this game. Goodbye, then. Stay safe. See you later, Millabelle. That is your name, right? I didn't actually look. Millabelle, yep. The banker. I hope you have... I hope you have multiple stations. Or I mean I mean I guess I can just always stag way over to you because you're right here, you know. Okay. So oh my god. No map. Remember, Wiggly, no map. There we go. Wow. Impressive. I'm so glad that you can go that far and still explode and get me. But I, I really want to know what you're all about. I want the flavor text, man. You gotta have the flavor. Dude. That explosion's so big. I'm, I'm so greedy. Okay, uh, right. That's that area. Am I just... Was there another way to go? Yeah, over here. I don't think I've been this way yet. Yes, I have, actually. What the heck? Am I am I being forced into going over there? 
to the fungal wastelands or whatever. Okay, I got, I got their thing. What does it say? Passive outer being progressive, protecting an aggressive explosive core. Ghastly eerie creature made out of thick liquid. You can peer right through them and you can't see where they keep their thoughts. And I don't trust them at all. Keep away. Okay. I will from now on. All right, this room. Wow. <laughs> this room seems to be my only real path forward. At least that I saw. Damn, that's a quick, a quick deal. I ran right into that wall. Okay. Nope. This is tough. Okay. All right, what's down here? Nothing, I thought that was a platform. I'm so dumb. Okay. There we go. What's up, dog? Nothing. Uh, well, not nothing. Actually, wait, I saw a sparkly. I was gonna go. I was gonna go further left, but sparkly. When things sparkle, you gotta go see what they are. <gasps> yes. Temporary health. I've never been happy. I've never been this happy to see you yet. I also got a hunter thing. Life seeds. Small scuttling seed filled with lifeblood, which can be extracted and consumed for its healthful properties. Uh, though. I got some sort of thing. Is that is that all it was? It was just that? Okay, okay. <gasps> no. Don't kill the butterflies. Hallow nest seal. What is that? It's not one of these. What is it? Official seal of the kingdom of Hallow nest, symbolizing the authority of its kings and its and his knights of his, of the king and his knights. The relic from Hellenes Pass. This item now holds little value except for those dedicated to the kingdom's history. Okay. Well, we've we found multiple of that genre of item now. So I wonder I wonder what the point of that is. There's got to be there's got to be someone, some sort of like shop. Or something where I can spend those. Also, this is getting very thick now. Um, I think we are. I think we're getting closer to the source of the greenery. Okay, that was a new enemy, Mossfly. Okay. Okay. What? Okay, we have a darkness barrier and a metal barrier. Can I? No. Okay. It was worth a shot. Okay. So over here we have nothing. All right. Well, uh, that direction seems like a bust, though. This direction is very interesting. So wait, then hold on. Where, where on earth am I supposed to go now? I, it's 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 looking more and more like the fungal wastes may be my only opportunity to move forward. Okay. Oh, there we go. And voila. I'm so glad that Skyflash31 <laughs> decided to come online. I need to I need to turn that off. Okay. Skyflash, if you're watching, thank you. I know that you watch my content because I know you IRL. Uh, this is the area that I've already tried to go back down to. There's gotta be there's gotta be something else here, right? Ah, uh, there's a direction right here. <gasps> I hear him. I missed the map for so long. I could have gotten it. Okay. Where are you? How the hell did you get over here? You suck. You suck. Why? <laughs> Why, man? I just... 
<laughs> just want a map. Oh, dude. Come on. Come on. Alrighty, since I can't seem to uh, find anything else to do in uh, Fog Canyon, I suppose it is fungal waste time. Even though I was much more interested in that other area. Uh, papers again. How did he get here so quick? Alright. We have a we have a little map thing with uh, several uh, Among Us boys on it. Unfortunately. Ooh, okay. This area is getting cooler now. Lots of mushrooms. Shroomage, even. You suck. You suck. You're really just gonna pummel me with that, huh? Okay. Alright, we have more of this standard enemy. Alright. And this enemy, too. He just decides to explode even bigger than the other enemy that liked to explode. What is his name? Fungling. No, that's that dude. Fungified husk. Oh, it's a... Ooh. It's a fungus-taken-over creature. Yikes. Nope. Okay. There we go. Alright, this area seems quite difficult, though maybe... maybe a bit easier? No, never mind. I lied. Oh my god. Okay. You can't even hit those, like, back at them. You gotta, like, properly avoid. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Alright, give me my stuff back. Thank you very much. I'm a little less upset about that death than I would be because I uh, put all my money in the bank. All right, this uh, this fungified husk enemy seems very similar to the uh, the other dude that likes to explode. Okay, I don't have a map, but why were there why were there um papers earlier? I can't I can't hear or see him. I need to avoid that. Get that thing away from me. Oh, and it's timed too. Okay. All right, just go quick. Don't even, don't look back. Just go. Oh, you asshole. Okay, what is it? Hello in a seal. Okay, we have two of those now. Let's get out of here. Uh, no thanks. Oh God. Okay. <laughs> Damn, dude. This game's aggressive. I like it. All right. Uh, yes, I know the stack station's that way. Thank you. Um, but what is this all about? Oh, I see that he's weak now. I didn't even realize that I was only down to one one piece of health. That was the first time I noticed his uh, his idle animation. I don't want to deal with you. No, sorry, Mr. Sp Sporg. <laughs> I can destroy the shrooms and turn them into smaller shrooms. Oh my god. Leave me alone! Okay. Let me out of this hell. I don't like it here. Okay. Maybe I preferred the jellyfish, because at least they would only do it when I killed them. Are you going to explode? No? Okay. I just realized that was a money mushroom. <laughs> Like the last hit that I hit on it, I was like, "Huh, that's got that's got money in it, and it's a shroom." Crazy. All right, lots of one way one way doors here. And over here we have a guy. He's going where? He's sounding like halfway to being a shy guy. Who are you? Um, shroom warrior. <laughs> Fungal creature that attacks intruders to protect its young. Interesting. I like. I really like the sound he makes. I really like. I really like that. I don't know why. It's just kind of. It's just kind of goofy. Speaking of the young, it's time to slaughter. I'm hoping that there's not going to be an area where my dude can't breathe, but he's got no eyes and maybe no inner 
Because n- now that I've seen the shade, I'm kind of just noticing that he kind of just looks like a shadow with a head on. You know what I mean? And a coat. So, does he need to breathe? I don't, I don't think so. But acid affects him. Maybe we'll find out when we hit a, a, a water area, perhaps. Where does this take me now? Ah, the one-way door. Excellent. We can also go further up. And we have a, a big boy. Two of them, in fact. Okay. Your, uh, your spit leaves plenty of stuff to avoid on the ground. And also, it looks like <laughs> you're just gonna go that hard, huh? Uh, your, your shroom, your bell, your cap? That's the word I'm looking for. The cap of your shroom um, blocks damage, and that's no cap. Or perhaps it is. That's dumb, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're goofy. Get out of here. Okay. And we get a charm notch. <gasps> yes. Is does that do what I think it does? Yes. Excellent. As so not only can we equip a uh, a third charm, but also we have uh, space for another. Okay. I thought those were going to be two separate upgrades, but no. It is a uh, it is one solid deal. It's a whole package. Ooh, we're mixing uh We're putting water in the mix. Maybe maybe this is just the game's water. Just the acid? I suppose that could be. Or maybe it's just boiling water. I don't know. I love the coral. I really like this game's world. I think it's really interesting. Hollow Nest is a pretty neat place. Wow. We're just uh <laughs> I'm just that good, huh? Okay. You know what? Uh, that way seems to be not 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 my kind of way. I think um, so. We're gonna go further right toward the uh, where the Among Us sign is pointing. I think. Oh no! I need to heal. I need to heal. I need to heal very bad. Please, please, no! <laughs> oh, where did I? Where was my last bench? Oh my god! I don't even know if I can get back there. I don't even know if I remember the path. Oh, okay. So even though even though I uh, can't like see the map map, I can see the general direction of the shade. Okay, that's that's at least somewhat helpful. Where where's where's Cornifer? I see your pages. Where are you? You're down here. I didn't go down here. What's wrong with me? Hello, please. Oh, they're bouncy. Ooh. <gasps> Whoa. Okay, that's fun. But first, Cornifer, give me my damn map, bruh. Ah, uh, my short friend, you've caught me at the perfect time. I'm just about to finish charting these nauseous caverns. Very territorial types make their homes within this area. I suggest avoiding them where possible. I see that. Further below, some strange, thin creatures gave me quite a scare. They seemed an intelligent bunch. In my youth, I'd have braved their caves, but I fear my matured physique would be able to outrun the <laughs> matured physique. Were, were they to run violent? Okay. No, dude. I give you a map as a gift, but I don't think my wife would be very happy if I did. All, all, our, all our food is made of Geo, as they say. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay, well, at least I know where you are. I need to go get my shit back. Hold on. There you are. Oh, God. Don't make me do this now. Okay. There we go. Come on, get out of here. Don't want to deal with you. Oh, I like the noise you make, but you are a very, a very obnoxious enemy. Oh, man, but... 
Should I play it safe and go all the way back to Cornifer? Or should I? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to. <laughs> I, uh, I really, I really would like to, um, get that map. Just so that, it, it, it just seems like the better option, you know what I mean? If I, if I just go along the way and I die again, then it's going to be even harder to find where that was. Uh, also, we just got a, a new, a new entry for this guy. A shroomling. A young fungal creature spends most of its time in the ground, but can uproot and flee if it senses danger. Look, looks like an ordinary mushroom until you get close. Then it pops out of the ground and starts scurrying around blindly. Very, very amusing. <laughs> I like the hunter. He's funny. Hello. Map, please, sir. I know it's my own fault for not having found you earlier, but... There we go. Okay. Wow. Pretty big. Wow, even. Okay, there's a there's a house over that way, and I'd like to see what's in that. Okay, well, it looks like we have a, a direction to go now, thankfully. I really like these bouncy mushrooms. I think they're neat. Oh, okay. I see what you want. That's cool. There we go. Okay. And there, the money's just kind of going all over the place. Okay. Give me the Geo. I want it all. Okay. What's further down? He said something about something he wasn't able to handle going on further downward. Because his, uh, his, his very mature body can't uh, outrun whatever's down here. At least that's what I think he said. Maybe maybe I'm misinterpreting. Uh, well, damn. Okay. Guess we are not going this way. So, in that case, I'll just meet you guys back up where I was before. Alright, here we are once again in the room that I died in previously. And we have more of uh, these guys. And I don't really feel like fighting that dude anymore. You know what I mean? I think I'm just I think I'm just kind of done <laughs> with that enemy type for now. Uh, this enemy type though doesn't seem too bad. Okay. Um, further right, there is nothing. Well, there's there's something here. I don't know what that is. I keep seeing that that specific thing around. I don't know if I'm just not well versed enough in like bug type stuff or if it's something that I just should know or maybe it's a lore thing. There we go. They're pretty generous on the time they give you to uh to avoid the um the thingy from the sporg. That's rude though. <laughs> They're not very generous on the distance. Okay. Charging on up and going on forward. I hear something clattering. Oh, uh, what's going on? Hello. Okay, you're a friend. Hi. Cloth by Noah Sturtridge. <laughs> uh, hello, Cloth. Aha! The tiny steps of a tiny creature. You've got the look of an adventurer, so we've much in common. Searching for dangerous places, I. Well, you're on the right track. A long-necked critter warned me of a tribe deeper down. Warrior sorts, so she says, and I'm itching for some serious combat. Hmm. Okay. Keep sharp, my adventurous friend. Stay alive and let's meet again on the road ahead. Sounds good to me. Okay. You seem cool, Cloth. What is this? What is... I keep joking that it's like an Among Us thing, but it's, you know, it's, it's not. I don't know what it means, though. I think I've seen that sign before in a different area, too. Uh, first, though, I would like to see what's over to the right over here, because I haven't seen a bench in a while. We remember the Elder. Is this a, a grave? 
Well, I, I can't believe I just asked that question and then defiled the area. I think I'm just gonna leave. Doesn't seem like my kind of place to be, if you catch my drift. Okay. How do you... Where are you coming from? Are you able to just, like, swim through the water? I wasn't hiding, you know, just napping before I head off again. Bound to be facing even more deadly beasts soon, so I gotta keep me strength up. True. Okay. See you later, Cloth. You stay sharp, too. Okay, we got more, uh, more bouncy shrooms. Ah. There we go. I don't like how, how far all the money bounces. <laughs> Makes it difficult to obtain. There we go. And onward. Over here we have more mushroom stuff. That I'm just going to completely ignore by falling to the ground entirely. But over here seems like a secret. Ooh, they're getting smaller. What the... Why did I do that? Okay. What is the point of that? Why? Ah, there we go. Shortcut. Okay. It's a very dangerous shortcut, though. <laughs> we go. Bouncing along. We have more stuff to see. Hello again, Hornet. I see you. I know you don't want to see me, but I'm happy to see you. Because you seem like a very uh, forthright individual. Okay, why am I going that way? There we go. Yeah, get back. Very nice. Always nice to get more soul. And more geo. Okay. So what is this place? Why... Why was she over here? Hmm. <laughs> Rude. Here ends the pilgrim's way. Hallowness's heart lays open before you. Proceed onward to share in its glory. Um, well, it doesn't seem like I can, uh... I can go that way right now. But perhaps there is an alternate way I can go, um, around. Over here we have, uh, more shroom boys, of course. And more shroom money. I like this area. It's definitely it's definitely not my favorite. I think I definitely like a green path more. But I think this area is kind of neat. I really like how far they're uh, they're pushing the um, the mushroom and spore sort of theming about it. They've got sporingy mushrooms. They've got several different like poisonous enemies that are difficult to deal with. Makes me a little worried if they tackle like a, a more poisonous area later on. Cause you know, anything related to Dark Souls plus poison is just a big, uh, a big yikes for me every time. All right, there we go. And I can't get up there. There's got to be, like, a super jump or something, right? Or maybe, like, a hover. Could be that, too. Uh, oh, I just noticed that the right stick... I was curious what the right stick did, because I've never tried. And it just automatically moves the camera around. There we go. Hello? Oh, you're, uh... You're an enemy. Okay. You did not look like an enemy to me. You look like a friend, but... I was mistaken. Who are you? Mantis warrior. Oh, it's the tribe. Okay, okay. 
It's a Amazonian tribe, even probably, because um, mantises, uh, female mantises, um, after reproduction, they uh, they eat the male's head. I feel like that's a that's a fairly well known fact. Uh, mantis youth. Cool. Okay. Okay. If you're wondering why I'm not reading the entries, it's because oh yeah, I equipped the the getting hurt thing. But I wish it had a little more range. Though I guess if it had more range than that, it would be pretty broken. Also, their bodies just kind of snap apart. That's kind of brutal. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go, but I guess it's where we're going. Nope, couldn't couldn't pull that off. Get out of here, mantis youth. Um, I guess we're just kind of forced to going further down. Which is not the direction that I wanted to go. Unless there was a path to the right? Maybe? You respawned already? I'm not quite sure. Ah, yes, there is a path to the right. Um, I'm not quite sure what the rules are for enemy respawning. Sometimes it seems like they respawn as soon as I like exit the room. And sometimes it seems like they only respond when I rest at a bench. So I had no idea. Uh, Wanderer seeking death, welcome. May you find swift end upon our claws. <laughs> Yikes. Well, at least uh, at least it's cool to see a functioning civilization in the midst of all this. Nice to see that the uh, the manti mantises. Um, have found a way to persevere. I guess there wasn't really anything much of note over that way, except for a little bit of a little bit of lore, which is important to some people, and I am one of those people. They're kind of frail, though. It really only it doesn't take that much uh, that much to take them down, and they're also pretty easy to deal with for the most part. There we go. So I feel a bit I feel a bit bad. Oh my goodness. Honestly, the youth is more difficult to deal with, I think, than the actual like proper warriors. There we go. Now, I don't like I don't like no, I don't like falling and then not being able to see what I missed. That's so rude. All right, I see a lot of light in here. Do we have a, a bench? Maybe, please. There's a mask on the wall there. That, that, that looks pretty cool. Um, there we go. We can hop on along. Mantis Village. Oh god, I didn't want to. I didn't want to intrude on that quite yet. What kind of a bug is the knight? I actually can't figure that out. Am I like a beetle? I think I think Beetle is probably the most the most likely candidate, right? This uh this this thorn thing seems to be pretty good. Come on. Damn it. I'm starting to get uh locked off by a lot of um high jumps that I can't make. Oh, and there's something up there. Ooh, hot damn, okay. Once again, I would really like to have a counter. I think that would be something really fun to have in this game. And what's a, what's a soul's adjacent experience if you can't parry, right? Alright, I have no idea how long this episode is. Um, it's gotta be longer than normal, though. And that's fine. I'm cool with that. Did I open the uh, the gate here? Yes, I did. And they tricked me. I thought that I was going to be able to just get it right away, but I have another little hallway to go through. Mantis Claw... Press X. Oh, it's a wall jump. I didn't even consider wall jumping. Jump from wall to wall to reach new areas. Cool. Okay. 
<gasps> and we can do the uh, the broken. <laughs> it's just a Mega Man X wall jump. <laughs> okay, okay, sounds good to me. I won't complain about that. Very cool. Okay, I like that. Absolutely zero complaints coming from my general direction. All right, and now we can just kind of completely explore this area, it seems. Um, I think we can also, there was that tiny little like cave in the, the queen station that had a, um, oh, what's this? The truce remains, our vigil holds, the beasts are kept at bay. Um, there was that tiny little like um, way to go in the queen station. That maybe there was something we could do with the wall jump. Um, I'm not. I'm not feeling confident enough to make it through that right now. As much as I would like to try, I haven't seen a bench in fucking ages, so uh, I'm not feeling particularly adventurous in that kind of endeavor. <laughs> I hope you understand. Oh, but it... Hmm. I'll be back for that. I will absolutely be back for that. There we go. I like the way the wall jump feels. The wall jump feels very... Very natural. I like that you don't have to do it in the, uh, the early Metroid way. Where you have to, like, press away. From the wall. You asshole. Stop. Please, no. Wow. I got one hit in. Oh. Damn, dude. Okay. Well, I suppose in that case, I will end off the episode there. Damn, this game's getting really hard. <laughs> I'm liking it, though. I'm loving it. I'm having a great time. Thank you all for watching this episode of Let's Play Hollow Knight Blind. I've been Guildmaster Wiggly. If you enjoyed the video, please consider giving it a like. If you are new, consider subscribing. If you want to follow my Twitch, Twitter, or join my Discord, they are in the description. And I hope to see you all in the next one.